Hello, 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 and welcome back, everybody, to a bit of bro -dado. You are joining me for my max recording session so I don't struggle to keep up uh, while I move houses. And today, we're going to play the bull, I think? I like the idea of it. Um, you unlock this character by just finishing level one, I think, and he can't carry weapons. So he kind of runs around a little bit, and then when he hits things, explodes. It's very fun, um, but I struggle with this because I don't invest heavily enough into health coming back to me. So realistically, we want just damage percentage and health and maybe even some um, HP regen. So let's start trying to get ourselves into a good position. We're only buying... Um, we're only buying these sorts of items. Although, thinking of it, we could buy turrets. Let's buy a turret. Maybe that might come into hand. And landmines. Ooh. This build might come together, you know. We didn't get anything that we wanted, but that's fine. We've got a turret and some landmines that will slowly spawn. So basically the aim with this character is to kind of dodge a lot at the start because you don't want to waste your explosions on just like one guy. Because if you waste it on one guy, then you, you're losing too much health. Um, but if you get a group of guys and then run through, you can then kind of maximize a little bit. So maybe we could do with some speed as well to outspeed these guys because they are a little fast. They're chomping at my uh, my rear a little bit. Um, armor's maybe not bad as well. Uh, we could take that, but that's all our money. So let's lock that maybe and re-roll for a second. Um, I do like pickup range. Yeah, let's get pickup range, I think, just so that we can grab things without having to, because when we're running through, we could miss a lot of things. The turret's actually helping quite nicely. I can't complain. Um, that was a good investment. Maybe more turrets would be a, a nice thing for us. Yeah, look at that pickup range. That's much better now. And then basically once the wave's near the end, we just run through this horde. If we align it with a tree as well, we'll blow up the tree at the same time. Um, but we're just trying to keep healthy. That's the main thing. Ah, oh, I saw the guy. We all saw him. Let's get some speed going. Um... Let's take that, finally. Reroll. Damage, we're not using range. Um, elemental damage, I don't think, affects explosions. Um, and we'll probably just reroll. Explosion damage, yes, that's good. Okay. So that'll increase our damage quite heavily. Yeah, the turret's going to help with the shooty boys, I think, a fair bit, actually. Because they get a bit annoying, because you don't want to, of course, run into them straight away. So it's a lot of dodging their bullets. Um, ooh, perfect. Beautiful. Look at this big horde here. And bam, 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 bam. Bam, bam, bam. And then we run away and just kind of heal a bit. It can be quite a nice build. I've never wanted it, though. I have tried a couple times. Oh, we need to claim all of that. Two seconds left. Just run through and claim as much of it as possible. Uh, damage percentage, I think. Explosions, good. Damage minus range, good. Uh, explosion damage, yes. Landmines, yes. And we'll take a baby gecko. Um, I think that will do us quite nicely. Okay. We just got to keep pumping that explosion damage up, because the more damage we can do, the later stages, the better. So damage percentage and explosion damage. Oh, I see a tree... You see a tree, oh, dodging, dodging, and then, there we go, run on through. Feels really tense to do that turnaround and blast back through them. Oh, lovely. That actually, I think, was more the mine than it was uh, anything else doing damage there, which was nice. Oh, another tree. Trees would be good, lots of trees. Because again, health from trees. We just have to damage ourselves to get the health unlocked, unfortunately. Because it's the only way we can destroy trees is actually run into things. Uh, chance to heal when picking up materials. I will take that. Uh, let's take damage. Let's then take health. Dynamite first. I think we'll take both of these. Don't think this is needed. 
Oh, perfect. Explosion damage. I think the garden might be quite useful for us. And then the lemonade because of that. HP recovered from consumables would be quite nice. So our explosion damage should be quite high now. These guys are a little bit annoying because they do a charge. But I think if we just... Ooh, that's fine. Nice thing is if we do take damage, we kill everything currently. Um, I'm not even able to see how much our explosion damage is doing. But I know it's doing a fair bit. Look at this little little group of friends. Isn't this cute? Nice and relaxing. And I've seen a tree, so we're going to lead them all down to the tree. Follow me, brothers. Follow me and death to you. <laughs> you just absolutely blitz through them. It's quite fun. And then straight through again. I don't know why I struggled so much with this build. Although I'm saying that on wave 6. Let's, uh, let's be a little bit more reasonable. Because the thing is, these guys do very little damage to me. But it's the big guys that hit for 10, obviously, that start to get a little bit more spicy. Ooh, lovely. That, that, and that gives us a nice boost of stuff. The alien eyes would give us a different type of damage, which would be quite nice, I think. Um, we don't really care about dodging, so that would be quite good as well. The piggy bank, I just don't think that'll work for this build. I need to be spending my money too much to, um, too much to getting upgrades. If we're not getting enough upgrades, we're, we're going to struggle. Because um, that's our issue right now, is if we're not pumping out the damage with this explosions, they're going to catch us and then really kill us. Let's get that tree. Lovely. A little bit of food. And we've got the garden over here as well that we can always pop over to and nibble away at, which is nice. Uh, let's then... Bang, 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 bang. Oh, there's a guy. Hunt him down. Problem is, he doesn't die in one hit. There we go. So we have to tank a couple of hits to get him dead. Um, but it's no real issue. Uh, oh, and the, do you know what? The... The mines are actually doing really good. I'm wondering if they're affected by the explosion damage, or engineering only. Because if they are affected by explosion damage, that will be nice with this build. Quite nice indeed. Uh, ooh, no, let's recycle that. I'd rather have the damage. Uh, let's reroll. Um, health or, or armor. Let's take the armor, I think. Oh, lovely. Uh, I think we want that for sure. Let's take the eyes as well, and then we'll come back for the acid. So now we've got a turret which will heal us on occasion as well, which is nice. Perfect. And then we just kind of dodge these big boys for now. So that they're not going to do too much damage to us solo. And then once we've got a big enough group of them, then we'll run through them. But of course the mines are... Ugh, see, he hit us, but that's fine. The mines are helping us a little bit, actually. Do you know what would be quite nice is Pocket Factory. Because then destroying trees would spawn turrets and it would make our lives a little bit more reasonable. Um, but that's fine. Let's come over here and then just plow through for a second. Because we're plowing through with the garden as well. So we should hopefully be getting some health back. Lovely. Come down here for a second. Perfect. Ooh. Yeah, I mean, they, they are lowering our health on this wave already considerably. Um, but that's fine. We can live with this. Uh, Reroll. We want maybe armor or speed. Let's go for speed because they are starting to get a little bit faster. Perfect, some landmines. Let's just reroll then. Uh, Reroll. Landmines, I'll take. And I'll take that next round. Perfect. So we should have lots of landmines spawning, which is quite nice. Because they'll make our, kind of, running our little hurdles. Oh, look at that. A little bit more reasonable. Because they'll thin the herd for us before we have to actually do anything. So we really just want to focus on speed with this. I mean, they literally, it's blitzing them. I'm not even getting a chance to really do what I need to do. Uh, which is good, actually. I can't complain. Uh, let's get that tree knocked down. There's another tree over here. Let's see if we can... Get that knocked down. Oh, do you know what? This is feeling quite nice. We just want more um, more turrets and more uh, more C4. And we can kind of let this build run itself a little bit. Uh, let's just make sure we're trying to carve down these trees for any extra boxes. It doesn't look like it. Oh, we're running low on time. Let's just run through, kill as many things. That's fine. That's a good bit of money. 
40 harvesting, 1 damage per second. I don't think that's worth it for our build right now. Um, we've got good HP regen, but I'd rather not take the damage. Although, does that mean I'll constantly be detonating? We'll try it. We'll try it. That might that might be really good. We might be constantly just exploding. Take the damage increase. Take the armor. We'll then take the dodge and the scar. Take that for cheaper. Uh, Reroll. Ooh, another garden. Yeah, and a cute monkey would do us good. Um, we I don't want them to be faster. Oh, we are constantly exploding. Okay, that's actually not the worst. As long as we can heal through it, we're just kind of constantly a danger to them without having to take the damage from them. So if they get too close to us and follow us, we're just going to constantly be giving them a bit of a spicy time. Ooh, that's worked quite nicely with this build. I presume I can still, yeah, do extra explosions for running through. Yeah, that's worked quite nicely. Because we're kind of just like a roaming bit of damage now. If we could increase our explosion range, oh, then we'd be talking. We'd be talking because, and we don't have to wait for people to take down trees. So we just go and stand next to it. Ooh. Oh, this is good. Ooh, this is very good. Every second. And we're going to get 40, um, 40 harvesting from this. That's pretty good, you know. Ooh, we do need to be a bit careful, though. Running through like that. That was quite ris risque. Ooh. -y -y -y. Okay, it's fine. <laughs> uh, yeah, we can take that. We're, none of that affects us anyway. Damage, yes. HP regen, I think we've got to take. Uh, health, yes. Reroll. Armor, engineering, max health. Yeah, because we're doing a fair bit of engineering stuff. Uh, max HP, damage, armor, speed, crit chance, yes. Consumables, yes. Ooh, a laser turret. That would be quite nice. Um, Reroll. That's quite nice as well. Let's just go into the next round with those two saved, I think. And all of our goodies. Yeah, because these guys, so these guys are the guys that I was most worried about. Because look, they're very fast. But if they're just slightly in my range, they're just going to take damage while following me. Oh, this was the killer for me previously. Because these guys follow me and then just batter me one at a time. But if I can have them just follow me as a group and slowly get damaged, now we're looking good. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Okay, this build is having a good look at him. He's just following me. And they all of them do that. And if at least I can kill them by staying slightly ahead of them. Oh, my God, yeah. Okay, this works. It's a little risky. We need to be a bit faster. We want him. Did we get him? No, we didn't. I think we got him that time. Just got to run through. <laughs> Plowing them down as we go. Yeah, it's fine. Cool. Cool and collective. That's what we want. Um, let's recycle that. It will definitely take a cheaper, cheaper time. Uh, armor, yes. Let's take the laser turret. Let's take the armor. And the consumables, yes, that's really good. We should be getting a lot of health from consumables, which is good. So we've got two gardens currently, and we can destroy trees at will. So, quite nice. And we've got that health turret, perfect. Just got to get our ring going, where we've got everyone following us. Currently, they're all spawning in a little bit hectically. Uh, once we got our... Oh, damn it. Our ring got destroyed based on the fact that <laughs> they all walked over a goddamn mine. Okay, it's fine. We live. We live. How much do we get? Like, plus five, I think? From food? Can't even see. Because we're never, we're never that low on health right now. Ooh, but we'll get low. I'll tell you that now, for sure. Okay, it's fine. The laser turret's still doing its thing, which is nice. It's a good addition for us. I think we just need to run through every so often. Make sure we're not putting too many enemies on the map. Or else that's what's going to kill me as well. Yeah, I struggle with the timing of when I should actually, like, brutalize and just run through. Um, we could do the engineering, but let's just go for the health. Um, that's good. That would be sad for our engineering. Um, 
That's good though. That's good for us. Um, we're not we're not relying on it. Let's leave it. Um, max HP minus. I think we can take that. Uh, we could take another one as well. Armor and I don't mind it. Um, yeah, and let's let's go to the next wave. Let's not spend too much money spinning the wheel as per as per, per se per se Percy. Good old Percy. And then we just run. We, just, we want more speed, that's what we want. We want to be a little bit faster. Maybe like 10% faster would feel nice, I think. Um, just to have a little bit of an edge. We've got tons of mines on the, on the board, though. And then we just run through. Yes, look at us. Carving them up. Slowly and steadily. The slower enemies are great for this build. The faster enemies, not so much. But then we just run on through. Yes. Turrets and mines are doing their job anyway, which is quite nice. Lovely. Diving through. I feel like a dolphin. I'm just like jumping out of the water and then just gliding on back through. And then jumping out again and then gliding back on through. This is very peaceful. This is this is this is Zen for me. Living the life of a dolphin. Uh damage. Boost that damage for us. God damn. Uh, armor and dodge will take, uh, definitely take that, uh, re-roll, ooh yes, I did say 10% would be quite nice, so we'll take that, uh, we'll actually lock that in, uh, and we'll lock that in as well, and that's recovered us so much health actually, um, and we can, we've only got one of them right now, right, we've got two, so a 16% chance, so this will double to 24 now. Which would be nice. Our character looks like an absolute mess, though. <laughs> we need to hang around to stop these boys from spawning so many goddamn bullets is the problem now. These are the waves that really get me, because there's so many bullets being spawned and thrown at me that, like, I just take so much damage. But we're, we're taking one damage a second right now and healing through it, so I can't be too mad at a couple bullets here and there. Oh, but they are doing five to us. Eek. Can't take too many of those. Okay, we've got to dive through. We've got to dive through. Problem is with these guys, they run away. So for this build, very hard to pin them down. Um, but with the extra stuff that we've got on the board, like the turrets and the landmines, I think it is helping us a little bit so that they're not lasting as long as they might have done previously. We just need to keep eating veg. Eat your veg, stay alive. Eat food, don't die. Eat that food, you won't die. Okay, we're good. Uh, recycle that. We don't need that. We do take damage. Uh, we take this. We take this. Oh, pocket factory. Yes. Let's re-roll one more time. Uh, just to see what we get. Nothing. Okay, well, we're definitely going to get the pocket factory. Because that will... It, it just does good. I, don't, I think it's probably the most useful item you can consider getting is the pocket factory because for just the simple fact of destroying a tree which most builds encourage you to do anyway um, you get a free turret it is a no win no wait it's a no brainer sorry <laughs> I'm, I'm trying to big it up and then I'm going it's a no win <laughs> obviously you do it <laughs> just an idiot like that would be an extra turret there plus the turrets shoot the trees so they eventually just create more of themselves which is quite cool. Uh, again, that would be another turret. Just pumping out, even if it was pumping out one damage a second. Well, not a second, but you know, one damage a hit. Like, that would still be worth it to me in the long run. Versus, say, like, not having that extra little bit of damage. Quite simply. Um, ooh, I hate the screen getting dark. Because it makes me feel like I'm really low on health. But with this build, I'm, I'm not really. Um, pocket factory, done. Uh, Reroll. Chance to do damage randomly, sure. Uh, attack speed, crit chance, range. No, but we will take the extra um, stuff. Nothing great. Another medal? How many medals do we have? Two at this point, okay. Um, yeah, I mean, we're not... We're not re-rolling again, so we'll, we'll live with that, but Pocket Factory should help us a fair bit. Now we've got the highlighted enemies, yes, the, like, the elites. So as long as we can kind of stay near them. There we go, that's fine. Another turret spawning. 
beautiful. Give me those trees. Let's just run through this group of elites quickly. Try and thin them out a little bit. Ooh, come over to these mines, you fools. Yes. Taste explosions. And then we run through. Oh, perfect. All of the elites gone. This guy's generated another another turret on that side of the board. Lovely. Oh my god. We might actually do it. We haven't won with this game for a while. I've won off camera. Just bear that in mind. I'm not I'm not terrible at video games. I have won off camera, but I just you don't see them, you know? It's what a coincidence. <laughs> Sounds like such a lie, but I have. I've been doing stuff. I've been unlocking things and enjoying playing this game off camera as well as on. Uh, let's take this, let's take this, reroll. Another medical turret that'll do us all wonders. We could take a bait, but no. I don't think that's worth it for us. Uh, we could take that, but I, I also don't think that's that worth it for us. Um, this is all oh, 2 HP recovered from consumables. We will take that. Uh, and we will. We'll lose 1% of damage for a little bit more health. My god, look at this monstrosity. <laughs> I think I'm also um, net neutral with health gain. So I lose one point, but I gain that point back really easily. So it's not too bad. Just have to run through those guys sometimes to try and tame them. Ooh, they are just about keeping up with me though. It's not great. Not great. Not great. Run through. Hope to dear god we survive. Oh, this is bad. Oh, this is very bad. Oh, we need food. We need food. Oh, they're so on our tail. We're not fast enough. We're not fast enough. We're not fast enough at all. We need to run through and hope that we do more, more damage. Oh my god. We are not fast enough. We're gonna die. We are going to die. It's happening. It's happening here. You're witnessing it. You're witnessing it. We're not fast enough. Oh my god, more health. Oh, we're not fast enough. God damn, we're not fast enough. Okay, another turret. Yes. We need speed. I need to be faster. Uh, nothing's giving me speed. Uh, ooh, this is bad. <laughs> this is real bad. They are too quick for me. Um, I'm, if they're not super aggressive in this round, we might be fine. If there's lots of those enemies again in this round, we are dead. Because we cannot outspeed them, even though we've got another medical turret now. It's just not giving us enough safety we need to run through. Try and whittle down that herd. Okay, that's fine. These guys kind of manageable because they do their little charge thing. So as long as I can kind of organize them to be on top of some of our health, it does okay-ish. Oh my god, he says. Dying. Oh god, please. Please stop. Please. Yeah, it's gotten a little bit bad again. It's gotten a little bit bad again. Okay, two health picked up. Run through. Okay, that's fine. Yeah, 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 yeah. Give me a little bit of food. Yep, run through again. Ooh, some of these waves are thick boys. Okay, that's fine. Um, HP regen. <gasps> HP regen is doubled when you have less than 50% health. Yes, please. That will put us on to like 50 HP regen. Which, if I work out 1 HP every two... So we're on almost 4, 5 H... Almost 5 HP a second, right? So doubled is almost 10. That's pretty good. Ooh, torture. Restore 4 HP every second, cannot heal- Oh, but does that negate our HP regen? Yeah, probably. So we don't want that. Um, this is not bad, it's, it's dealt some damage. This is gonna help us loads, I think. Potion of HP regen. Basically, as soon as we hit like 40 health, we should start to just like pump up again. If I'm understanding this, this is wave 19 as well. One more wave and we're big boss time. So we better get our stuff together pretty quick in this wave. We better feel happy with the build or else it's gonna struggle. Um, I don't feel mad bad about this. It does really depend on the placement of our like health and stuff. 
if it's all compressed a little bit, it can be difficult because getting to it is a little bit tough. But with this build, to be fair, when I drop below 50% health, my HP goes like, tr like doubles. That's not bad, is it? Because it should come back up really easily. Oh, there's the boys that are going to kill us, though. There they are. Okay, so now we're on, like, super health regen. Now we're off super health regen. Now we're back on it. We're just going to fluctuate, aren't we? But we did we did win. Let's take that. Uh, think the damage. We're on 100 damage now. We take the elephant. We could take this in the hopes that there's less enemies. It's not the worst thing. Um, turret, sure. I, I suppose now we could invest in a little bit of engineering. It's not the worst. Um, and we just go, I guess. Oh dear god. Okay, so we could try and just rely on surviving the 80 seconds and expecting the turrets to do the killing. Because he's going to be hard to kill because standing next to him will do us in. Um, we could rely on sort of flybys as well, a little bit. Like if we can stay near him, ish, we'll do our we'll do our explosive damage. Oh, we're not doing enough. No, 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 we can't stand there. That was that was poor. That was poor. So we're gonna test something that I've never done before, which is, do you win if you just survive the si sixty seconds like every other round, or do I have to kill him? if I have to kill him, life's going to be tough. Life's going to be very tough. But if we can just live, I'm not as mad at living. Living's fine with me. Um, because we, we kind of have this build set up to survive. Like, we're not taking that much damage. We're over halfway through. He's taken, like, no damage, though, admittedly. But we heal fast. Everything that we have is built to bring us health and joy and happiness. Oh my god, dodge, 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 dodge. I dodge, dodge. Ooh, just walked right into that one, didn't we? Like an idiot. Okay, six seconds until we find out whether I'm correct or not. Three seconds. Two seconds. One second. Run one. Okay, so you just have to last. That's very good to know. And we've unlocked the gnome, which is melee damage, elemental damage, range, and pickup. Okay. Not too bad. Well, thank you very much for joining me today, and I will see you guys in the next one. Oh wow, you've actually made it this far. Okay, um, three things. Um, don't forget to maybe watch another video, I don't know which side I'm on. These ones, this or this, there's a box with a video. Um, consider subscribing and maybe like the video. Leave a comment, I'll, I'll say hello. Anything. Go, go wild. <laughs>